The leadership of the House of Representatives has met with the nation's security chiefs in a bid to find lasting solution to the worsening insecurity in Nigeria. At the end of the more than four-hour meeting, both parties expressed hope there would be remarkable improvement in the fight against banditry moving forward. National Assembly correspondent Jokandisa has been on the story. We had maybe considered to be jokers. After last week's outburst by the Deputy Speaker over the absence of the security chiefs, all those invited are here to dialogue with the leadership of the House. The spike in banditry attacks in Kaduna State and some other parts of the country is the reason for this gathering. Deputy Speaker Hamid Idris sets the tone for the meeting. The primary aim of any government is to protect life and property. And this is our core mandate as assigned to us by the constitution as, and the house is so worried the you. security chiefs and the minister of transport say they are receptive to new ideas that will eliminate insecurity i'm ready to answer the questions that you have for us with respect to you know solutions collective solutions to the defense and security issues across the country. We did apply for surveillance, what you mentioned it here, and I may have to respond to that when the committee decides to ask questions on that. And to say that it is also not true that your lawmakers, there is no law that says if you want to do a $3 billion contract, your other business must have gotten to $10 billion. The, major incident the speaker is concerned about the non-implementation of the recommendations of the first National Security Summit brokered by the House. Those resolutions were presented to Mr. President uh, sometime last year by the whole leadership. And I believe many of you, many of the service chiefs were present and you had copies of the of those resolutions. Uh, we want to find out how far with those resolutions. The meeting was then taken off the glare of cameras and the doors were shut. After more than four hours, the meeting ended on a fruitful note. We talked about um, training and retraining. We talked about the issue of capacity and allowances. But we talked about several several things. A lot of them, like I said, touch on security. But for us to have been in there for four or five hours, um, you must know that we've, uh, we made some, uh, um, some good headway. Expectations are that are rising from the outcome of this intervention. Cardinal State and indeed other parts of the country will have some respite from recurring insecurity. Chokia Adza, TVC News, Abuja.